So this is the third in our three videos on how to use Leica Exchange. Leica Exchange is a service that allows you to transfer data from your Leica Captivate field equipment to the office. In this video, I'm going to show you how to use Leica My World to transfer data using the Leica Exchange program. Um, this is an option. Again, there are several tiers of Leica Exchange that you can purchase, and this is an option that when you talk to your dealer about it, make sure to ask about the Leica My World transfer. So again, what I'm going to do here from the main menu of Leica My World, I've already logged in, I'm going to go to uh, my, highlight my applications, I'm going to go down to my trusted service, and then I'm going to select my exchange. Once this comes up, I will need to log in. So it comes up with my username. It remembers me from the last time. I will put in my password. And unfortunately, in this one, you do have to agree to the terms and conditions each time. I'll go ahead and say log on. And you'll notice here that it comes to my inbox. And I already have a file here that is um, ready for me to download. So I click on it. It'll come up. It actually popped up a box here off the screen. Asked me what I want, what I want to do with the file. And just your typical Windows download, I'm going to tell it to save the file. Press OK. And the file here has been saved in my downloads. And then I can certainly, of course, then go ahead and move that to wherever I would like. If I would like to transfer a file to someone else uh, from my world to the field or to another user in a different office, I can go to my exchange, select browse, select the file you want to transfer. In this case, it's a text file. Press add. It adds it up here. Make sure it's highlighted. And then if it's a text file, make sure that this box that says job file is not checked. Select the person it's going to. Press exchange. So now I can open up my data collector. Go to like exchange. Press get data. And you'll see I have a couple of uh, different control files. These are data files. So when I check the box and press next, that file will be stored in the appropriate location on your data collector and then you're finished. So again, that's like a My World Exchange and hope this video has been helpful.